In this video, I want to demonstrate how to shell and add these fillets to our water meter housing. So I'll control tab back to my other part. First, I want to add a quarter inch fillet to the bottom edge. So I'm going to activate fillet. I'll set my size to 0.25. I'll select the bottom edge. The preview looks good. I'll right click to accept that. Now next, this fillet tends to give people a lot of grief and I suspect when I try it, it'll fail the first time too. So I'm going to activate fillet and I'm going to set the size to 0.175. And then I'll select this edge and this tends to go well. Then I'll scroll around over here and I'll select this part edge and it selects the whole edge, but the preview's gone away. And if I hover over these, we can see what's happening. None of these selections are helping me out. So when I say OK, it won't do it. I'm going to get this message. So I'm going to close that and I'm going to cancel this fillet. The trick I've learned, and I'm not certain why this works, but it does work, is before I activate fillet, I'm going to come over here. I'm going to right click on this edge and I'm going to tell it to select the loop. It's not the loop I want, so I'm going to click on the yellow arrow. That is the loop I want. So I pre-selected the edge, then I'm going to go fill it. The size will be 175, because that's what I did before. But now I have the preview, and it's working. So then I'll select this one, and I'll right-click, and my fillet worked. So I don't know why. I've looked into it. I've never been able to get a good answer. But pre-selecting the edge and then activating the fillet seems to work for these fillets that want you to give you grief. So our next step is to shell the part. So I'm going to activate shell. I want to remove these three faces. I'm going to make the thickness 0.175. I'll say OK. My part looks good. Always check it out. I'll put it back in the isometric view and I'll save my work. And then the next video will continue from there.